Are you ready to learn the easiest way to animate your bit emoji in PowerPoint? Keep watching. You'll start with your clip art. I already have my bit emoji selected. Um, you'll go to the top where there it says animation. You'll select add animation. I'm going to start with appear. So I would appear in that slide. I'm going to go back and add animation again, and I'm going to do a path. Down here are all the different path choices. I usually go with a custom one for the vacuum where you can swirl around a little bit and make your own path. But just to keep it simple for this tutorial, I'm going to go with the line. You'll have a green dot and a red dot. You'll go ahead and highlight the dot, drag yourself forward or backwards or whatever direction you want to go. And in this line, I'm going to go forward. Just like that, you already have your very first animation. We'll go up to the top and preview. There you have it. So that's our first animation. I'm going to go ahead and add another animation to this. So I'll go back up to the top and I will select add animation. This time I'm going to choose the swivel. And that way when I go forward, then I will swivel and turn. And go ahead and preview forward swivel very simple right here you can change the speed if I drop it down the last thing I did which was the swivel it'll speed up watch this and if you increase the number it'll slow down so right now we're going to add one more transition I'm going to do the bounce and that's what my assistant did in the very beginning of this video going to go ahead and preview so drive forward the line swivel and then bounce in in the very far corner of the screen you'll see um, all the animation pane and you can access that through the very top of the screen next to add animation um, but this shows you the order and we're going to change the order I'm moving bounce all the way up to the top so that'll be the first thing I do we'll go over to preview and I bounce in and now I'll drive forward and then I'll swivel. We can make some other edits to that. I go back and get my panel and say I would like to remove that swivel. Right there, you can remove the very last transition. Preview, bounce in, drive forward. So you can have fun with this. Um, another thing that you probably want to pay attention to is right here. Um, you want to do after your build that way it continuously go and you, you won't have to be in presentation mode where you have to click on it so those of you who are familiar with PowerPoint would probably already know how to just change it to um, the animation starting with the previous build so you can use this window or you can use the animation pane window but you can change the duration to make it slower or faster play around have fun I did. Um, I hope this explains how you can quickly animate yourself. It's really simple. The key is to play around.